Have you ever been in a situation you forgot your bowstring? Not a problem. I got you, Bo. I got you, Bo. You know you travel a little slow, but your arrows travel really fast. How you kick some mass. I got you, Bo. making a bowstring out of today. Some thread. To prove that this is actual thread, I'm gonna break it in half. When you're making a string, have it longer than your bow. Way long. All right, you can have it attached to a stick or another object. Make sure that object you can wrap string around. Wind the string around and make sure you keep it nice and taut. To mix it up, you can add another string to make it look more interesting and colorful. Wind it tight, and the next step, we are going to glue with contact cement. You can use any other flexible adhesive and cut then tie a knot at the end, wrap the string around the bow, form a loop, take that string up and into the loop, forming a knot, and tie another knot that should look something like that. It's important to have tension on the string when you are making the second loop. Hold the bow and the string similar to the way that you string a bow. Make sure you have the tension quite tight, similar to as if it had a brand new bow string. Make sure the second loop is slightly bigger than the first. This is the bow string I made, so we're going to string it up and fire some arrows at times 8 speed. The white shaft arrows came from Epic Armory, not sponsored by the way.